just me and the old man watching match of the day, watching the highlights. It gets to the kind of shite games. And I say, right, I think I'm, I think I'm going to go to bed, Dad. Good night. <laughs> and he would continue the charade. And he'd say, are you off to bed, son? Good night. <laughs> and there was that mutual father and son, we both know what the plan is here. I would, <laughs> I would casually exit the living room nice and slowly, good night, <laughs> hit the hallway and race up the stairs. Don't even consider looking in the fridge, eyes on the prize. <laughs> Upstairs, bedroom TV switched on, go to number six. That's when you see what he's watching, TVs are synchronised. Six, we're in, he's in control. <laughs> A few minutes go by and he's still watching match of the day. That's fine. Well, he must be given it a few minutes. Oh. <laughs> don't want to make it too obvious. Yes. He's done this before. <laughs> Five minutes go by. He's still watching match of the day. I'm thinking, come on, stick to the plan, Andy. <laughs> I'm looking at the bottom left of the screen, waiting for the numbers to get typed in. The numbers that could make or break the evening's entertainment. <laughs> Go and give me your numbers, Andy, come on. Nine! That's a good start, nine. <laughs> could not have hoped for a better start than a nine now. <laughs> Zero, five, the ten-minute free view. You're a dirty bastard, Dad, but I love you. <laughs> Give me a quid or you're getting stabbed. <laughs> Just you.